How to stop a money tree from dying A money tree, or Pachir aquatica, is the indoor version of the Malabar chestnut tree. In the wild, this tree can grow to heights of 60 feet. As landscape plants, they usually remain around 15 feet, according to the California Rare Fruit Growers Incorporated when potted, grow as high as 7 feet. The potted plants are most often referred to as money trees. Traditionally thought to bring good fortune to the owner, they are sometimes given as housewarming gifts. Things you'll need Watering tool Insecticide Pot Potting soil Balance 2020-20 fertilizer Check the environment Make sure the plant is protected from hot, drying winds. This includes any heating vents for indoor plants. In addition, this tropical tree should not be exposed to freezing temperatures. Test the soil moisture. These trees prefer soil that is continually moist. Wrinkled leaves indicate a lack of water. Water potted money trees once a week, but do not let the soil get overly wet, as this may lead to root rot. Yellow leaves show you the plant is getting too much water. Remove from its pot a money tree that is wilting all over replant it in new, fresh potting soil. Examine the leaves. Many house plants, including money trees, suffer from insect pests such as spider mites and mealybugs, according to the California Rare Fruit Growers Incorporated. If you see tiny bugs on the leaves, stems are all over the plant, take the money tree outside and knock the bugs off with a strong stream of water. Then, spray the plant with an insecticide. Look at the light at the plant's location. Place your money tree where it is exposed to several hours of bright, but indirect, sunlight. Too much direct sunlight may scorch the leaves, causing them to drop. Give your money tree some food. Fertilize it with a light, water-soluble fertilizer with equal amounts of nitrogen, phosphorus and potassium once a month during its growing time spring through summer. 